Essence has the best energy in the world and every time you talk to her, it just feels like, wow, I feel very invested in and cared about and cool because Essence is so cool. And if she's talking to me, maybe I'm cool or I could be cool if I hang out with her enough. I'm Ashley and I think that all the cool stuff you see online doesn't have to stay online. I'm gonna bring one stranger's digital style to life by giving their space a makeover based on their social media accounts. Hey everybody, it's Ashley, and today we have a very exciting episode of Spacelift. We are going to New Jersey, because that is where Essence Grant lives. She's a senior beauty editor here at BuzzFeed, and she has a closet that needs a little bit of help, even though she's like the most stylish person I know. Take a look at what Essence sent me, and you'll see what we're working with. Hey Ashley, it's Essence. I have a load of makeup, hair care, skin care. It's literally part of my job to get free beauty products. I have no system, no way to organize it. Here's my closet. I've had these storage containers since like college. I'm like ashamed to even show you. Also, I don't really have a place right now to do my makeup, so I'm always running back and forth to the bathroom. I also do my makeup a lot on the train. If I could have a place to do my makeup in my home with lighting, that would be amazing. I just basically need you to fix my life. Make me a functional, organized adult woman. Instantly when she sent me that video, I was like, I have the perfect idea, we need to make this happen. So today, we are making over Essence's closet. We are going to give her the ultimate glam station where she can do her makeup, clothes, hair, everything she needs in one organized place that is also really, really cute. First, I'll use all my detective skills to try and find out who they are and what they like. Then, I'll have two days to completely make over the space in a way that perfectly fits their personality. Finally, the big reveal will show them the new space and see how well their digital style translates into an awesome new space. Essence is so cool. I don't work directly with her, but you know, we're like office friends. I really wanna make this space awesome so that like, low key we hang out now. <laughs> All right, I am ready to do some research. Let's try and find literally anything Essence has ever posted online and design a room based on it. I'm gonna start first with Instagram. Okay, she obviously is very active on the platform. It also seems like she likes to change up her look a lot. I don't know what that means for the color scheme of the room per se, but I do think we need this space to be really organized so that she can reach for all her different beauty products and make whatever vision she has in her head that day come to life. Now let's try Pinterest. I'm not really getting like an interior design preference, but I do think it's confirming the fact that we need a lot of space for a lot of beauty products. Also, she has one smoothie board with one singular recipe on it. I don't think we're gonna address that in this makeover. Finally, Essence is the only person to have ever sent me a Twitter account. So let's take a look at what she's tweeting. I love this picture. Like not only does Essence look super gorgeous, but I think we may have just found the color scheme for this room. I'm scared to commit, but also not at all because it's really pretty. And I would love to see a space made from these colors. Okay, yay, that is like a weird find. Okay, I think I have enough information. Essence has a really good digital footprint for us to work with, so let's get started. We are on our way to New Jersey and I'm getting a little bit nervous because I'm going through our list of amazing projects and all the things we have to do and then I'm looking at the traffic, which is terrible. Hey Google, how's the traffic? There's heavy traffic. You should reach your destination by 6.16 p.m. Great, that is a solid hour after I'd want to be there, uh, but you know, that's just the way the world works. I don't really have control over these things, so I'm just gonna prep extra hard right now, and then we're gonna get this makeover done. I just got here, and I am pleasantly surprised because Essence's closet is actually bigger than I thought it was going to be. We have more stuff to organize, but we have more space to work with. I've got six projects for us to do today. The first thing is paint. I really don't want this to feel like a closet, so I picked this really nice blue color inspired by Essence's Twitter photo. I have these floating shelves to go on the back wall, and then we're gonna put a desk slash vanity right in the center. To be a beauty guru like Essence, you need good lighting all the time, so I'm gonna give her a lot of lighting options in here. I have a pendant light, then I'll put a desk lamp on the vanity for more close-up lighting. She had these awesome shelves already in the closet. We are just going to repurpose them for makeup storage and her shoes are actually gonna go on another piece of furniture which previously housed her makeup. She actually doesn't have too many clothes so all of those items are gonna go on a clothing rack in the room and we're gonna spray paint that lavender to also complement her Twitter photo. And that's all our projects. Let's empty out this closet. What is this? 
I think we just found Essence's original Instagram. This is so cute. Okay, this is the face I want Essence to make when she sees her closet. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does that. These are great. We'll just get her bed risers and put these under the bed. Did y'all just witness that revelation? Cause it just happened right here. Ideas on the spot, man. That's how we work here at Space Flip. The first project that we have to do is paint. I'm just laying down a little plastic so that we don't get any paint on her nice floors. Also, Steph is here to help me today. She's gonna help with a couple of projects. We have this beautiful blue color, pretty much straight from her Twitter photo. Me and Steph actually took the picture with us and put the paint samples against that. I won't waste too much time telling you all the ins and outs of painting because Steph just put out a really great painting 101 video. I will link that in the description if you are interested in painting any space. She goes through like literally everything you would ever need to know about paintings. I don't know why I didn't decide to change my shirt for this painting project. However, I will say I didn't get any paint on my shirt, so go me. Hooray! All right, closet is painted. I finally put on a painting shirt. Now it is time to go spray paint the clothing rack, which is gonna go right here, and that's gonna be a really cute lavender color. Let's do it. We're gonna have an exposed clothing rack in the room because Essence's clothes are so cute. Who wants to hide them in the closet? In the photo, that has pretty much been the inspiration for this whole thing. Her shoes, you can tell, are a little bit of lavender, and I thought it really went nicely with the color scheme that we have going on. That's kind of it for day one. We have to wait for paint to dry, and then tomorrow we're gonna install the lights, put in the desk, and then we're gonna organize all of her makeup. So I'm gonna get my beauty rest. See you tomorrow. Okay, we're back for day two. I think it's getting there already. I'm really happy with how the paint dried. This is the current state of things, and you can see why I need to spend today getting organized. Let's get started. Originally, I was gonna install the pendant light to the ceiling, but then Steph and I had this great idea. Why not just put it on the rod that was already hanging there? So we did save ourselves a little bit of time and a couple of screws. Look at how awesome this light looks. We keep going back and forth between whether it looks like Pringles or Handmaid's tail bonnets, but either way, it's really cute. So the first part of organizing was dumping everything on the floor, and I was amazed at how much lip gloss and lipstick Essence has. I wanted to display those, because obviously that is her favorite beauty product, and I put them in these glass candle jars that she already had. I'm putting her palettes in a little folder organizer and I got these cute bins to house skin products and hair products. This is a fun little tip. In the drawer, I put a utensil organizer to put her makeup brushes in to kind of keep them in place. There's room to grow, but it's still organized and I'm really happy with it. For the next project, I am going to install those floating shelves. I think I'm going to display those glass jars of Essence's lip gloss and lipstick because I color coated them and now I think they look really cute and I know it's something she's reaching for very often so we want to keep them exposed, accessible, and also just looking really cute. The closet is complete and now we can fit those plastic drawers really easy under the bed so she had way more space in here than we originally thought. We just needed to make some vertical space happen and now the room does not look any more cluttered than it was before. In fact, I think it looks less cluttered and way more intentional so I am very happy about this. Also, how crazy is it that the makeup shelf that she had in the hallway perfectly fit next to her window and fit every pair of shoes that she had. That was definitely a meant to be moment. Okay, so we are done with the makeover and just in time, because guess who just got here? Hello. Welcome to your own apartment that I hijacked for the weekend. Thank you. Here we go. You've lived here long enough, you probably know your way. I feel like I'm walking into heaven because <laughs> it's so bright. You said you wanted lighting, so I mean, some of this is studio lighting. I'll let you do the honors. Go ahead and open your closet. You can open your eyes to open the glass. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> Ashley, you are like a genius. Look at this. Yes. We've got like general lighting so it doesn't feel like a closet, but then like when you need to do the makeup, this point it right so at you. Oh my gosh. That's what oh we want everything to be accessible God. and visible. Pinks, browns, glosses, magentas. I have a plant. <laughs> oh, but they're all fake, don't worry. <laughs> you know me so well. And then you incorporated my grandma's chair. Oh, is that your grandma's chair? Yes. Hey, Elsie. Oh. Yeah. Elsie's oh got a seat. Elsie's got a seat at the makeup table. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
Everything is here and it's exposed because all these things are so cute. Look at these cute little details. Like this is too cute to keep hidden. It's fun because like getting dresses, I go on shopping. Yes. You know? You're in a boutique. It's Essence's right. boutique. Right. And then we took what you had the makeup on in the hallway and it's over there with your shoes. Stop it. This is why you do what you do. I didn't even know this was possible. This closet is awesome. It fit the desk perfectly. <laughs> Right. Wait a second, where's Steph? Did I not say that was the face that I wanted her to make? <laughs> oh my god. I said that's the face that I want Essence to make. Yes. But she opened it. <laughs> oh my god. And I think you just did that. I, I think... love this. Do you think you can get ready here? Yes, can this... I can get ready here. Are you kidding me? You were already rolling to work looking like I'm getting ready every day. I'm like, like I'm I'm gosh. ready for Monday. But are you ready? <laughs> but are you know. ready? Thank you so, 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 so much. Aw, thank you for letting us, trusting me with your space. I literally trust you with my life. Aw, thank you. Like, oh my God. I needed this, because like life has been hard lately and this just makes me excited. Oh, good. Okay, well, I hope that you can just look good, feel good in this room. <laughs> <I'm so excited. laughs> thank you so much. Thank you, oh my Aww. God. vlogged any behind the scenes because it's just been too busy. It's been our first week of shooting and it's like, oh, we just finished Essence's reveal and I could not be happier. It's my favorite makeover and my favorite reveal, but don't tell any of the other videos that. That might be one of the best reactions I've ever had. I've done a lot of these makeovers, but I don't know if I've had anyone dance before. Thank you so much for watching. If you use any of the tips in this video, even if it's just like the utensil holder trick, please send me a picture. That totally makes my day when I see you guys using some of these tips and tricks in your spaces. And if you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the Nifty channel and I'll see you next week. Bye. You know what most of these were? Except for this one, I think, um, candles. Wait, I think I got that from you. Did you do that on I YouTube did video for Christina or somebody? That's where I got that from. Oh. Yes. <laughs>